Yo, what is up boys, Mo here, and today we're going to be bringing you a high kill solo game with the EM2 Assault Rifle. Uh, this thing has a lot of recoil, um, but if you can manage to control it, the time to kill on this gun is absolutely insane. Uh, in this solo game, we got over 20 kills, just running and gunning, and uh, yeah, I think you guys will really enjoy this gameplay. If you want more gameplays like this, smash the like button, subscribe if you're new, click the bell notification so you get notified each and every time I upload a video or go live right here on the channel. It's me, Mo. Peace. And you just take my kill. Thank you. And he just takes my kill. Oh well. Someone's here. Oh my god, it's a little billy bob, look. Enemy soldier nearby. It is a little billy bob. Are perks common? They they actually are pretty common. I'm pretty sure the gold chests, you know, like the gold chests, I'm pretty sure they're, like, guaranteed to drop a perk. But I'm not sure about that. Every time I've got a gold chest, I've always got a uh, red perk from it. I don't know if that's designed that way. But perk 2, like, the red perks are obviously the best here. Because that's, like, the perk 2 slot is literally, like, defend your entire class setup. Um, but yeah, from what I've played, uh, from what I have played, every time I've got a, uh, gold box, like, supply crate, it's always been a red perk. But yeah, they're pretty common, to be honest, like, you, you can still get, you, you can still get red perks from the, uh, from the regular chests, I believe, but, Yeah. I have engineer. Enemy UAV active. And objective is to eliminate the bounty target. This guy's going on on the roof. Not not a very smart play. Is he going to hit the balloon? My bounty looks like he's going to hit the balloon. How are you going to hit the balloon? Probably not. Yes, you are. I don't think you knew who exactly you were flying in on, brother, to be honest. I'm going to keep it a stack. I don't think you knew exactly who you were, uh, in fact, flying in on. Our loadout drop's coming in faster as well. So, yeah, that was one of the changes. Uh, that was actually one of the changes. Um, that was one of the changes with Vanguard Royale. Where instead of the loadout coming in at the end of Zone 1, it's it, the loadout comes in at the start. Uh, of zone one. It's definitely better than what it was. Just a couple of Billy Bobs. I only won that fight because of the, uh... I literally only won that fight because of the own gun. Because I wasn't even fully plated. And it's working. I'm uh, actually enjoying myself. Not taking the game too serious. Get recon up. UAV beginning flyover. Oh, he got gunned off the roof? No sh shot. No shot, he got gunned off the roof. Out of my way. I'll drive. 
how's your week been? Um, it's actually been okay. It's good, good. Pretty good. I uh, was having uh, actually a really frustrating day yesterday with my internet. I was trying to stream all day yesterday and I literally couldn't because of uh, internet issues. But we got them resolved. Big Kevin had, had the solution. I just had the factory reset my router. Gun. Now, nah, believe me, if I was, uh, if I was, uh, what do you call it? If I was actually playing and, like, sweating, like, and actually playing to, for the win, uh, I don't even think you would even have got a bullet off on me, to, to be perfectly honest. All you PC, all, all, all you PC players just, uh, like, I understand. I understand. EMS aim system Warzone is absolutely horrendous. 100%. EMS system Warzone is an absolute joke. I agree 100%. But at the same time, you're probably on 100 plus frames, you know, sitting on a nice, nice, comfortable, nice wide FOV. I'm sitting here on 80 FOV with 60 frames, if even. I don't even know if I'm getting 60 frames. He will be like PC Mastery is saying complain about controller. Yeah, I literally, I know. The first, my, I, I remember I played, um, I played PC on stream for the first time and in my first game I dropped 17 kills back in Verdansk. It's not that hard. A lot of PC players complain that, oh, aim assist, aim assist. It's not that hard. Um, can be played on a high level. Like, you can be a pro Warzone player. Oh, no, I'm dead here. You can be a pro Warzone player on controller. You can be a pro Warzone player on keyboard and mouse. At the end of the day, I think it's balanced fairly well. Controller and PC. Or controller and keyboard and mouse. I think it's balanced pretty well, all things considered. To be honest, is you, you the aim assist breaks on PC players a lot. So the fact that I even got aim assist on on you in the first place is looking kind of surprising to me. Yo, big Joshua, let's go, baby. What is up? How you doing, brother? Wow, mountain on the wall is literally a cheat code. Woke up with an extremely different mindset today. And, uh, yeah. Have a nice day all. Yo, peace out, brother. Final deployment is almost ready. There isn't much time. Gas is... I'm still in this. Down the final ten. Come out on top. This area looks so different with all the less vegetation and stuff. Wow, this recoil is something else to control. Five remaining. Wow. I don't know if you guys know what the EM2 is like to control, bro, but this shit is hard to control. Yo, Big Dan, what's up, brother? How you doing? Hope you're having a nice day, my guy. Wow, nice combat bow. Jesus Christ. Just became a member? What? It didn't nothing popped up? What? Get 
recon up. UAV beginning flyover. UAV beginning Yo, flyover. I appreciate it, bro. Nothing popped up. I'll take the wheel. Gas is inbound. I love how I, I have a trophy system on my vehicle, and the combat bow just literally goes right through it. I love Warzone. I love how balanced it is, bro, to be honest. Victory! This is what you trained for. GG.